Howdy, this is Marissa with Marissa Moments. So true story. I can recall growing up um, in my childhood home, there was a woman and this woman, she was an older woman with a bun, like an old style bun. And I can remember seeing her walking in the hallway and um, it was it was almost like an afterthought, right? It was just an afterthought because I wasn't seeing it with my natural eyes. I was seeing it with my eyes, right? I was, I was being called into the awareness of what was happening on a different plane beyond the veil. Now, mind you, I was very young and the people that I was surrounded by, they didn't know, you know? And, and so whenever I would share anything or anyone that I saw, then it would either be categorized as an invisible friend or it was just one of my quirks, right? It's one of those things that Marissa says and it gets dismissed easily. Now, I don't say that and I don't take that lightly because people only can work within the parameters that they feel safe in, right? So odds are good that the person that I shared it with or the people that I shared it with might have had the gifts too, but they learned to denounce it. They learned to fear it. They learned to mislabel it and put it to the side because that's how a lot of these gifts work as well. When we feel compelled to share our gifts with someone else, then nine times out of 10, they probably have that gift too because spirit, that's how spirit does, uses us almost like in, in a chess game, right? And makes us be the beacon of light for others so that way they can potentially see and recognize themselves, right? That's why we go with what resonates because when we tap into that that heart space and you say, okay, you know what? That sounds really familiar or that sounds like something I've experienced, then that's us just being reflections of one another and it's encouragement to tap in even deeper and further. But getting back to mediumship really quickly, no trust and believe that if you see something, someone, someplace, whatever it is that isn't there, right? You're, you're seeing beyond um, what the human eyes have been programmed to see. You're seeing beyond the veil. Understand that you are not crazy. You're just tapped in. You're in tune. You, are, you have accessed a hypersensitive portion of yourself that allows you to see beyond what we've been programmed to understand and acknowledge is what I receive. It's scary. It can be scary, but it's possible. And also understand that they don't have power over you.